The following feature is rated SM for spiritual maturity and is not intended for the immature who wishes to remain as such. The views expressed are not necessarily those of our sponsors as they sometimes could care less about what the host is saying but is more concerned about having their product on a popular show. Warning, small minds, listen at your own risk as this content is extremely overwhelming and may do further damage to those minds closed off to objective reality. Approach with an open mind as the heavy nature of the content will lick your chip. Your chip. In the meantime, 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 in between time, time in the meantime, in the meantime, in between time, boom 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 time. Yes, Rasta, I tell you, yes, girly locks the vice box. Yeah, man, my day, I represent, yeah, man. In the meantime, yes, one more episode, episode 22. Yeah, man, we are travel. <laughs> yes, and the title, yeah, man, the episode is entitled The Diluted Female. Part 2, I do believe. See him, Summer Bridge, yes. Yeah, man, see how so it go. Tonight's program, you know, is, is, is kind of like a summary of every, in the meantime, we are come down throughout the year. I bet you know for the item though, remember, say, the first episode of In the Meantime was recorded in, in December, yeah, man. 2019, to be precise, yeah, man, is a one-year anniversary. And big up everyone now, we join me upon the live, you know, yes, for this, this last episode of In the Meantime, the last episode for 2020, yeah, man. Not the last episode, you know, <laughs> not the last episode, the last episode for 2020, because somehow, you know, we don't listen fast. <laughs> All right. At this point, you know, I want to say I appreciate everyone who follow in the meantime, from the beginning up to this point, me I tell you. Big up people like Murray and them people, eh? yeah man, Courtney out of California, you don't know, Scotty and the whole New York. Tony and Edwards, special respect, Dwight Cooking Show, yeah man, as a loyal soldier and a member of the channel, and the members of the channel are people like one now. Philip Carr, big up yourself, you don't know, Kenrick Ash. And dead dogs, I hope I pronounce that right, yeah man, but big up everyone where, yeah man, where they on the journey with me from them till now. Many people didn't think me I waste my time with this program, yeah, because nobody now got take on to it. But again, this program here is not for everyone. It is who it is for. Many people say in the meantime, impact them life in a positive way and them life will never be the same going forward. I mean, I write with that. It means me never let down Zion. I'm just happy if you be chosen as a vessel for channel something that is higher than me, myself. And again, I credit Zion for making me get really serious about this journey. Yeah. So remember again, man, all when you forgot me, don't forget Zion. And if in the meantime mean anything to the item right here now, yeah, man, the item can mention what in the meantime mean and what kind of impact it make in the comment section. But yeah, man, yes, the work continues in a 2021 and beyond, yeah, man. Stir it up in a the early part of the year. Will it more music? Will it more something? I come for 2021. Follow me up on Instagram, at curlylocks underscore the vice box. All right, as usual, this section of the program is brought to you by Vicebox Studios, the vice of a nation. And Madvert Multimedia, if it's not Madvert, it's not an advert. And Kingston 13 Music and Kingston 13 Clothing. Jamaica's first dance hall related clothing line. So click the link down below, yeah man, for support a thing we may have a name. Clothing arguments. This is where me now make available some clothes we have on a lot of catchy slangs and phrases and arguments, yeah, when we use, when we create in our work over the years. Stir it up and otherwise. So click the link down below for support that. And talking about support, I see a few people a, a complain, say, too much ads depend on somebody video them. But you have to understand, say, apart from the few supporters, them now, the paid members of the channel, yeah, the channel is not getting enough support to sustain itself. <laughs> me don't like ads neither. Me don't like ads more than nobody else, you know. But the only way the channel has sustain itself right now. All right, watch out. Me have the analytics to prove, say, over 60% in Arasta, 60% of people who are listening are not subscribers. Is that so? Is that Yeah, me? man. That's really? not me, I tell you. Good God. That's... Virgin, ah, what do you think, Kazda? Let's pretend I don't know. You tell Come me. Come like you now, listen, Virgin, I think we have talked about from the beginning of the program, I even here before this program here. 
I think we name me Ness. I can't say that enough, Rasta. When most people think egocentric, everything is about me, my reality, no other reality outside of oh, me, see. So the only thing we are happen is my life, my outlook on everything. So enough of them mind, you know, oh, oh, just me alone now nah, subscribe, and me alone now nah, like, and me alone now nah, share, and me alone now nah, become a member of the channel. And if almost everybody I think the same thing, what go happen? No support, I guess. Exactly. A sad reality. Sad indeed, my brother. And that, what you think that make most problem can't solve in a relationship and them thing they bridge in? It's because everybody I tell themselves they are next one to solve the problem. Yeah, man, me I tell you that. I'm going to start noticing now a few times when me a premiere a, a, a video now. Sometimes there is this great delay upon the, upon the time of YouTube. Because you are the thing now. Sometimes when the item experience them kind of delay, you know, in terms of the time when the video is supposed to premiere. The first assumption is that I'm my fault. I saw something me do wrong, me put it up late. But sometimes the video them dead if it is and don't take into consideration, say, YouTube flag people video for make sure, say, these videos we are post, I put up on the platform is not something we are, we are counter narrative, you know, we counter, we contradict the narrative. We Babylon use and create slave. They do that, my brother. What do you mean if they do that? How do you say? A whole heap of content when not in line with them objective. Them demonetize because they want to discourage the creator of those content. So for the real supporters them of this channel, yeah, man. We are telling you something, man. Real talk. Can't keep up this thing. I can't keep this thing going. Yeah, man. Me I tell you that. Well, I better tell you, alright, watch I know. I, I feel say we may go do this here and now. I go and design a program for the paid members, them and now. Uh, them have access to every content first. And then eventually now it come down to the regular subscribers. But the paid members are gonna get bonus footage and content and them thing there. We're gonna set up like live question and answer sessions, yeah man, and thing. And we can arrange it for live one on one interaction them them way the same way. So yeah man. I mean, no, some people can't support for various reasons, finance and location or otherwise. But for those who can support, support. Because support is very vital to the sustenance of any kind of organization or movement. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Real talk. Can't keep up the thing, man. All right. This section of the program is also brought to you by Rebel 13 Collections. It's at Rebel 13 Collections for the finest in custom design, clothing and everything printing. Except fingerprinting. Also brought to you by Sheer Precision Barbers and the Cutting Edge of Style. Also brought to you by Next Level Fitness and Bunks About Kids Party Rentals. Yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, man. All right. May I get into this thing, I know. Press a button. There. In the meantime. In the meantime, and between time, what is coming is coming. All right, Super Cat, what is coming now? All right, yeah, man. Phone call, yeah, line one, yeah. Yeah, hello, good night. Yeah, man, in the meantime, yeah, man, good night. I'm not going to lie, I'm yeah. with the one, woman them side of the topic straight. <laughs> yeah, man, give thanks, give thanks, respect. But all the issues we are fake. People in the meantime deal with, you know, it's not a one-sided thing, so you can't deal with one um, side. Um, I just want to say... Go on, uh, Zotty Ramon, I don't say I listen to you in the meantime, I don't say I show up. Why you not on some of the blood clap call them? I'm not going to say that. You not tell nobody to say that. You not mind your pity them. You not tell nobody to say that. You not mind your pity them. You not mind your pity them. You stop pussy like jam, pussy boy. You can't look like L.A. Lewis chance of having any kind of blood clot sense. Look what you do, you can't deal with man, so I'm not business. I'm not business. Yeah, man, but, but, but calm down. You have, you have calm down. You have to calm down. I don't need to talk about scandal in blood clots. All right. Scandal in. Right. Tell, tell a friend them, or your friend. If you stop your eyes, I make me can't hear you. All right. So tell me something. Hello? Yeah. Uh, so you normally talk to Ramon? I'm all sad on this. Yeah. I'm lucky. I drove by you. I call me, come now. I call me, come tonight. Yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, man. Where, where your name? My name's Sherry. Yeah, yeah, all right. Where Ramon do? What exactly him do? Where Ramon cannot change. Him cannot change. Yeah, what Just say all, all about just a yeah. fuck fuck yeah. being dusty blood clot, girl. Yeah. My 
I have two pitney for the blood yeah. clap, and I have two pitney for him. And I tell you, them stepfather treat them better than him. Them stepfather is so much How long you better. How long you Do you have long you have the stepfather? Time? Yeah, about six weeks now. Alright, new pum pum for you. Alright, continue. Listen to me, sir. Ramon need for no say. It's modern day time now, and no woman don't need no blood clot, man. Need no woman don't need a man these days. We need Just the Ramon, you need for no say like a five five and ten cent thousand dollar candle for the baby there. But at least you might do something. Oh. Go ahead and take, Sherry. Yeah. Warm. I wonder if you are Ramon understand yeah, the psychological ramifications. Of an action oh, you mean if, on these children. Oh, you mean if I understand, my more than understand, my understand where you say, where you take well, me from? No, no, man, hold on, all right, yeah, 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 all right. Me know, so make sure now, so me and you, they on the same page, you understand? It's not me having some kind of assumption that you don't know certain things. So the question is no, Cherise. Well, you understand what I mean by psychological ramification? I want to you, right? sir. Don't try this. No, don't, don't try this. No, to man. Me. Don't try no, style me. Don't say. try style me. I want to see you. You're yeah, bright. Try, try make sure you understand me. Uh, what should you doing? You know? I actually think so. It's rough. The blood, it's rough, you know? Indeed it is, my brother. It, 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 indeed it is. My brother, there, there, there yeah. seem to be a sudden invasion of this kind of toxicity, especially where the well, females are concerned. Well, My brother, where do you think it's coming from? It has come from old MacDonald and his farm. I tell you, and it's no sudden, no not at all, Bridget. What are you saying? <laughs> you mean what you're saying? I want to know. All right, we'll talk about that later, Pastor. Don't worry yourself. We'll right. talk about that later. Right. Old MacDonald and his farm. We'll, yeah, we'll deal with that. But cherries, let me tell you something, man. Let me tell you something. Whether you like it or not, you're not something you're doing. Now, the fuck they will bring them two picnic, they don't happen by itself. We never hear about a half a fuck yet. I mean, I say this bridge in here. I mean, I know this Ramon bridge in here, but I mean, I nah, say if you're out there, like I kill his father, fuck down the whole place. But there is a way if you angle certain things if you're not big people. It's disgusting the way she hung up when confronted by ignorance. Yeah, man. To something found That's in your you statement, my brother. It's like she refuses to learn. That's where you go. I don't get it. Um, when we are dealing with right, so no, it's, it's a made up mind. That way I see a manifest through Sharice, you know, it's a made up mind, a mind where make up. Long before it ever reach her, I know she make it up. A centuries ago, old MacDonald make up that mine and give the first ancestor for her first ancestor, which was the prototype or original. Where copies of that original mine get passed down through the generations. Like how you born a CD of an original, like how you duplicate the original and it just keep passed down till it reach Cherry's family and surroundings and as she this now thing she make up her own mind. I know that mine, I tell Cherise, she, she know everything, she no need to know nothing more. And the ego, we are tell her, say, right now, she no be exposed to nothing else in her earth because she know it, I this. Fear reality is reality and that's it. Selfishness. Yeah, man, and, 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 and the same case for man too, for most man. And that's why most people cannot learn and grow because them know everything. The word of the day, by the way, is ramification. It means... A complex or unwelcome consequence of an action or event. In the meantime. All right. One more phone call, you know. Line three, Eel. In the meantime, Eel. Yo, brother, who are going, Elder? <laughs> Uncle Sachs, we are dealing with the bridge, Eel. Yeah, we are dealing with the bridge, Eel. We are dealing with the long time we deal with the Yo, brother. You see, the girl, the one going to hear Sherry, so just call. You want to talk a bugger thing about Ramon, this and Ramon, that, brother. Me not even don't call, you know me elder, but me a telephone me, you the girl I talk, me say, yo, me off the call. Cause me care and me leave the girl wicked, sir. What do you mean? Oh, you mean what me mean? Oh, I know. When Ramon have that a send a school and a get a bag of money and a bill address a shop, get them there. Me have that a fuck all boat. Oh, where? Me frightened to see how the girl I talk strong, brother. Oh, the man five grand this and five grand that when a she broke the money now. I love you, I Oh, you mean? Spend half a whole lot of money for me and a boy named Soldier. Him coming like the boy Elijah, you know, cause I don't know how him still want married Pinky, you know. After all of that, like a hobby of them hobby, you know. 
I don't know better. I don't know better. It's rough. Me I tell you that. It's rough. Bad. Me I tell you. It's a dog's world. Rough, rough, rough. Indeed, it is rough. Uh, me yeah, tell man. Come here, tell you, say. Cherise and all those like Cherise. We have followed that trend in the Agua and good at all. Yeah, brother. I thought me I said real win right now to all me fuck that all about, brother. Remember, let so me tell you right now, you know. Half of one of them two youth that will share about good of my own. Because I never fully come in here, you know. Half in and half out, you know. You know what I think of sometimes. Dada. Yeah, man, so that youth would have a one foot on all the half a year to me. Some of them. Ramon. Yeah, no, my brother. I know you would have listened to it, you know. Because your show and my show to you, know, Dada. Every time them drop me dead, you know. But brother, me I tell you, so sure is. And not even for the streets. She have for the supercontinental intergalactic highway. All ill and a fuck she raised them you to that me I tell ya. She did all over a place like a idiot show dog. But you are no uncle sir. Yeah, man. Alright, watch her now. Yeah. You know, so she did all over the place like, like a idiot show as according to you. But you, you, have, you have fucked this girl without boots, brethren. That don't make no sense. A real thing you are taught me, brother. That's why I say me the Africa lane for me to use them know so they must know what they must do. Real weak, I remember under this current social climate where things change up, you know. Because I remember, say, one time gone, I did death and tax alone, sure, you right now, them voting. Bun, bun, have a seat in the Senate. So, remember, say, the ball game can't play without both suit. I don't mean tell you no real way. That's a true, my virgin. Yeah, yeah, man. like that. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, Acknowledgement of fault. Oh, yeah, thing. yeah, man. All right. But, Uncle Sachs. Yeah. You know, I think so when they come from big old radio attack certain things about fuck and cherries and all kind of thing, Bridging say. Munchy, you, 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 you know, I think about Munchy when you think about them things, Bridging. Poop, I'm going to tell you this real way, brother. Watch out, you know. You know, I think, you know, I think, you know, Munchy them not listen nothing sensible, brother. And nobody when I munchy them circle not listen nothing sensible as how Babylon get for chick, you know. The thing not change, Poop, the rule are still the same. You want hide black people up lift men, just put it in a book or anything. Sensible of that, me I tell you. Right now, me can't say me fuck a hundred girl. Me can't say me fuck Munchy mama and her three sister them. I'm sure if you go home, go sit in a share and Munchy stretch out in a bed and wait for it done. Oh, you mean? Anything when me afraid, say me no want Munchy no right now. I Kim Kardashian, if you go tell her. I mean, I know she from nowhere. Yeah, man, I saw me positive me hide my thing them dollar. That, that me I tell her the style that they use for a wedding. day. Most people addicted to drama. Yeah, brother. Yeah, that me I tell you. Yes, Virgin. All right. I see him. So me have a Virgin name. Chris, you know. Yeah, man. Me and Chris in our investment and thing, and Chris to put him half in the investment now. So when me if reach out to Chris now, he say, how come you don't deposit your side of the investment? Me can't get Chris over three months. Me try everything, me dial him straight. And then one day, you know, me decide to me try a different style now. Me, me say, me go link him on WhatsApp, but you me set up the message now. Me just type in. Hey boy, you know, say you's a big pussy wall. Up at the top part now, and then me scroll down. I say, now that I open the message, that is me really want to say. I remember now, you know, say, months me I link him, and him I go up on WhatsApp, but him now nah, go in and me chat them. But upon a day, they know. Funny enough, me I tell you, as soon as me send the message, tick it on blue, ready for say, suck back yours. But him never ready for say, boy, me never really ready at this time for that deposit they are. Yeah, communicate effectively. It's a real problem, this virgin, me I tell you that. In the meantime. Yeah, man, if you know, so this is Leela Ike, and right now you're listening to In the Meantime with Curly Locks, the voice box. Check it. I spy, I spy, that you see something you might like. Boy, pastor, me I tell you, me I tell you, Rasta. Mm-hmm. It fuck up on the children, them, in, 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 in a this type of situation, like Sharice and Ramon, one way. One or both parents do and grow the fuck up. Indeed, it is very sad. Yeah, man, me I tell you that. It is a sad situation. Because most people in I West, especially black people, don't understand. So, them born in a daycare center and come up under some childish rules where ensure that them don't grow up. You believe that? Yes, man. How do you manage to keep arriving at this conclusion? My brother, I don't get it. Watch your man. All right, let me tell you something. So, you're blind, Virgin. You're I'm blind. Not, you're, I'm you know not. what she said? You know, sister, most people right now in our world, observe, look. Uh-huh. And she say, them still a play make-believe. Them are living in an imaginary world. Them still a play Dali house. You think so? When, when, you think they're doing that? Yeah, man, later on in life, them go on. If you, if you still a play Dali house, you don't remember how Dali house used to go? We used to play mama and papa. Make-believe. And many of we never survived childhood in terms of make-believe. And now we get big and think mama and papa 
at still a game where we start when we feel like and the game done when our parents call we and say go be and eat with dinner. We don't have the ability to adjust to the reality that we take for raise these children. But instead, we end up as people we ask reality to adjust to how we feel. But the sudden suffering and struggle we end up in. A. And no, for we end up all a blame the pity them for their for our choices. Yeah, man. Everything we blame, everything but ourselves. And we are never we yet. Not yeah. the world, but not we. Uh, isn't make believe necessary to an extent, though, my brother? Yeah, man. Make believe and pretend play is a vital. Part of with psychological makeup as children. Yes, man, when, when, when you're young, that help you. If you have an image, you put an image to how the world work. But based on the childish ideologies, I wish I said beliefs then, where we have coming up, most away, stuck in a make believe like a car was stuck in a reverse. Yes, at every level of your life, the idea has to come first. Yes, that's why you have to put an image to it. That's why they call the word imagine. Imaging. You understand? <laughs> All right. The image, of course, is to help you have a map, an idea or direction in which to proceed. The image or the idea of anything is not the thing itself. The TV or the phone where I watch or I listen to this thing upon right now was not a TV or a phone until it left the mind of the inventor and became a real thing. Just like relationship or anything else. It have to leave the mind and work have to do to make it become a real thing. Imagination or pretend play can only go so far. Every idea of a surrender to a process, we are going to bring it to life. So you're saying most people are holding on to the idea of everything and are afraid to do the work. Exactly. Them can't surrender to a process. Them just hold on to the idea of everything. Why is that your thing? Because self-responsibility was never at the root and not at all where we condition to believe only entitlement. Because of this egocentric, ethnocentric outlook on everything and everyone. The world and everything is in service to us. I cannot say that enough. So there is just me and me and me are the most important thing. Reality serves me and everybody else I think the same way. Can I break down the reason again? Because... The ideologies are the beliefs then where the, the immature beliefs will make with belief system where underlay or lay beneath with belief system. Make with too self-conscious and obsessed with everybody opinion away. So we end up walking in a million directions and try to please everyone at once. Yeah man. Because look at Sharice you now. Listen to she go on. Listen to her friend in the background and go on and go on the most way. But one of the most dangerous thing anybody can do to them relationship I let in too much people in them thing and make everybody know them business. You think so? Yeah, man. Really? Yeah, man, because watch I know. Mm-hmm. When you are your, your partner have all a minor argument in the world, you could have overlooked it. You, know, you know, so we are human and tempers, flare and That's dating. True. That's and true. you run go tell everybody your business. You take with the option to fix them little minor something they in private because you know we're so addicted to people's opinion. I got embarrassed to go back to your spouse. You know? takes yeah. over. Yeah, man. Yeah, all right. It come in like some situation where, let's say a girl love run go tell her family everything. And, and, and she and her man have a little minor argument with escalate and turn into something where it no for go. Brother rush those band with last and man a run and people get arrested and kind of fuck with go on. The plot thickens. Yeah, man. Excess drama. Yeah, man. To the fullest. And then after that now, when she realized the boy, you know, say, I really yeah, fear fault and she feel like say yeah, things could have deal with better. She know if you start hiding and talk to her good good husband. Because we are brother know where you know play superhero and draw last night like defenders of the earth and rush husband. I go say. Him sister one big idiot. So she knows as a big woman if you start act like a little teenager sneak around with her husband. Because she won't keep her brother and that eventually I go push with her husband. And some people talk, you know, some women then, for example, would talk because them love the feeling of knowing, say, at a moment's notice, them family ready to protect them, you know, them love that, you know. But that can become dangerous, as me just described. So, unless a man beat you or abuse you in any kind of way, man, you have sense enough, you know when to talk, you know, and you know what to talk. Certain minor things can keep to yourself, or you think certain relationship with public, certain way, cannot last. Because too much valuable opinion in other relationship, it have to get fucked. So, Sherry's, you can't stay to take boots in. You have a member say boots by any level can bust and everything get fucked. Everyone is trying to serve too many masters, you're saying, my brother. Yeah, man. Yeah, man, we're too busy if we be still. 
to stay one place to have the focus to walk in a particular direction and make any particular desire manifesting the way we want it because what everything what we learn to see as happiness reside outside away and tied to somebody else's opinion and ultimately them approval there is no us you understand mm -hmm. the true character where we really need to develop in order to have the authentic happiness we reject it every day we can't take maturity to develop the character there and what is maturity in my definition the courage to be irrelevant. So we're stuck in this cycle of slavery to the same immaturity will make we unhappy. Because in other words, yeah, everything what we believe and oh we believe it and every single value what we have lead right back to the spirit of competition and not cooperation. And this again is very dangerous to every level of relationship where you can think about. And remember now, you know, so we have beliefs will lead to a constant downfall. And I it build with subconscious reality. And we are addicted to these beliefs. And them create actions that we're not even aware of. And these beliefs are with identity and the ego stand guard and I protect this identity from any kind of information. We're gonna ask if you adjust these beliefs. It's like when people make up their minds that they're a Christian and say, oh, nothing, nobody can teach them nothing. So they will never find out. From the Buddhists, the deep deceptions of the ego are from the Hindu, the theatrics of the actor called the person. I mean, I have no judgment for Sharice or anybody like her. They're a prisoner of them ego. I'm going to show you, I'm going to show you how far the ego willing to go to protect you from your own upliftment. I have family, friends, and even women over the years. Well, on various occasions, I show them certain things and me I try all the reasoning and thing and when them see the objective truth in a way me I say them cut out the argument and walk with some time and them not even them are like them not interested and one or two hours after that or maybe a day after that and them circle you back and try to teach you the same thing where you tell them you know? that's so true I experienced that myself my brother and I've often wondered why is that so I've often wondered that uh, because uh, uh, the one word again, familiarity. You understand what I deal with? Most people in your surroundings that you're familiar with, three quarters of the time, you cannot teach them nothing. They not go allow it because that's going to mean that so you're above them. And so for them mind work, you know, Bridget. Such a shame. No matter what you teach them, man, them quick forgive everybody else in the world. Quick figure credit to people who are not familiar, man. Yeah, man, I'm Malcolm X. I'm Marcus Garvey, man. They reach out of Africa and I say, I'm Mugabe, but I never you yet. Cause he no one around you and, and, and I tell himself say you're above him because remember again that's how he mind work. Even if I don't say your mind work, I know your mind you just humbly I share some information. No man, them are compete straight. Them are dominant in every situation. Them are ruler. That's why you see some people, you know, no matter how much documentary them watch, how much podcast them listen or how much book them read. The information can't help them because they are compete with the very information with it enlighten them. Why is that though? Because them spontaneous approach to information are for fine rebuttals or for counteracting. You think so? Yeah, man. Few times you see them in, a, in the meantime comment section. I struggle for find something negative. And now nah, make no sense. I say back all things when we just say. Like a name say so. That's why most people cannot learn because the mind where they might try to use process the information. No right. I, I hear what you're saying about immaturity and everything that you've been saying. Yeah. And um mm. what would you say the ultimate unhappiness in, 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 in all relationships on every level comes from my brother. Regin, me answer that already all the time. Because we have a belief system where make we come to define success as having more done or being better than everybody else. In other words, win to win everybody. If you get to that place, they will we are the top of the thing. So we end up now, cannot satisfy with nothing because somebody can always have more than we. So we end up addicted to the spirit of competition. And this competition, I you know, take we away from the present moment of our life at all times. We're always half in that tomorrow. Can nobody know for beat, we nobody know for more than we. We have to come out on top. This habit here, again, is why most people not even know when them rich. None at all, Rasta, because somebody always have more. A man I come from a situation where, you know, eat all the three, four day, broke like several dogs. I remember, I'm telling you already, you know, him go beg God, say, God, give me a million dollar, man. I can't take care of myself. I'm a blind mother. 
And Jesus go say to God, say, give him, man. And God say, no, no, who this, you know. Jesus say, who are you one, man? Just give him. And God say, all right, show you something. Say, five there. And the man get five million, all right. And now as I hear things that they care about him. Friend, no, go get ten. And him broke again. So God go give him fifteen. <laughs> God go give him fifteen. And the friend, the friend, no, go get twenty. And then the man, and then God give him twenty-five. Then him friend get 30 and now he must just out for himself. He get 40 and it never stop. It's a cycle. And we deal with every level of our life, including relationship the same way too. Because nobody can ever be enough for you because somebody else always seems to have better. So we stuck on a hopeless treadmill in pursuit of something that will never come. Because we actually, st we just stuck one place and I don't know so we now move. So, my brother, um, so they need to compete and to be relevant and to be important, etc., my brother. Aren't these baseline human needs? Yeah, man. Then uh, uh, hold on, yeah, yeah, my brother. Yeah. It sounds like you're saying that we should not have these needs. I'm kind of confused, my brother. No, pastor, man. No, man. Don't get me wrong, you know, my bridging. Remember, you know, I always say, you know, humans have certain baseline impulses and every part of human nature is vital to a survival. But it's where we believe and how we believe it turn these vital impulses, these vital parts of our nature. Against we, we have certain baseline human needs. The need to be relevant. The need to be important. All of them things there are natural. So what we're supposed to have. But how we think turn these things against we. In the meantime. All right. Why not news are now? All right. Jamaica band. UK flights, yeah man, grounds all UK flights and bands, incoming flights, yeah man, from the UK to Jamaica because of this new strain of coronavirus, yeah man, the government take quick evasive action, which is commendable, but there are, there, there's, a, there's a lot of questions where we kind of remain, yeah, because a lot of things I don't think most people consider, you understand what I'm saying? And these are just suggestions. These are just the next angle of, of this thing. This is not me calling nobody idiot or incompetent. And these are just sharing information, insight. Yeah, where maybe, where, where maybe some other people are overlook. <laughs> you understand? But my thing, and anyone, anyone can correct me, you know, if, 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 if every other flight from every other country been banned too, you understand? In order to avoid this new strain of coronavirus because in my mind, in my outlook on the whole thing, anyone in the UK you know, can just take a flight to New York and then a Jamaica them there. Or anywhere else in the world for that matter. Exactly, my, my brother. Bridget, may I tell you that? It don't make no sense. It doesn't. I don't think it, it, it make any sense, my brother. So watch I know. On to other COVID-related news. All right, watch I know. It is said that Cuba is in preparation right now for vaccinate for them 11 million citizens as well as many other people in many other countries all over the world. Some people say them now nah, wait. Many are flocking to Cuba right now for this vaccination. Yeah. Because why? Cuba is world renowned for the medical expertise. And it's often touted, you know, touted as having the best medical practitioners in the world. But here is where it gets interesting. Apparently Jamaica rejects the Cuban vaccine. According to health ministry officials, the Cuban vaccine is not approved by the World Health Organization. Christopher Tufton told the Gleaner, and I quote, As of now, our vaccine options are confined to the COVAX facility that we have signed on to and coordinated by the World Health Organization slash PAHO. This now means the Pan American. Health organization. At this point, me I tell some people now, say, nobody no really need to know Spanish or if you know if you talk English. If you know by now. Many people must know by now. So when me I talk about for years about this kind of organization that is World Health. World Health Organization now have nothing to do with health. A world sickness organization this. They don't make profit off a wellness. A sickness. Them create and prolong sickness. Then them create and sell the drugs. Them sell you the drugs. We deal with the, with, with the symptoms and not the cause. So you can just live long and suffer and them just make a bag of money off of you. Them exploit mankind's natural fear of death. 
So we get up on them drugs that try to live and I know say so are dead, we are dead half. It rough. My brother. Yeah. Do you feel that um well, uh, Jamaica has a covert reason to, to reject the Cuban vaccine? Because I don't see why if um yeah. a country that is world renowned for its flawless medical practice would be rejected solely on the grounds that their vaccine is not World Health Organization approved, my brother. I don't, I don't get it. Me could not be too hard pan pan the government, pan either side, pan none other side them, because watch I know, I'm sure you something. I go and say something, I think I did say in the first episode of In the Meantime, Rasta, and it's that the governing body of Jamaica pan both sides, many people pan both sides, turn Jamaica like, uh, all right, what I mean, all right, let me use that one, you know. Turn Jamaica in like, uh, you ever see them naive Christian girls there where them think everything just good with the world, no, no evil, no night, man, and them now nah calculate in a reality. Yeah, man, so them meet this guy where them say, them friend, yeah, man, them friend, the person that's half of them be a thing. What you want? What you want? Money? <laughs> at the least. Clothes, oh my God, you need some fashion. Yeah, what you say? Bills won't pay. Hey, I'm going to buy JPS for you. Don't worry about it. And what? What I was at to, man? And all everything your heart desire. Yeah, man, and she married to you know, all this. I make him know I am married, and yeah, so I have, I have good morals and things, and him said, that's the least at first. There's usually a catch. Then yeah, when them take the man things, a portion of things, you understand the man, say, what, well, give me a little of this up, no? Here or no? Oh, you forgot I am a Christian, and I'm married, and I can't do that. And the man, I say, hey, girl, how you take, how you take man for? Give me back me something there, man. Give me back my money and everything when me give you because me have my receipt. And when she remember now, so she done model upon her family them and church members and be a thing, you know, can remember, you know, the most important thing to the average person is what people think about them. So the man just notice her face change and she have to go all into it, man. The man just say, oh, go in another room, they go skin out and prepare your tongue for wash body. Good God. And she a complain, say, all, and she put the little cold gate upon a wire brush. She still can't get out the taste of body every morning. For years. Good God. And the man, they now come in like the first world country. Them like a first world country. We have put Jamaica in a all kind of position. And sweet, sweet, beautiful Jamaica have a cock up. And cooperate with anything at all with that country they into. Compromise. Yeah, man. Come in a face. Hot candle wax. Tie up. Beaten. Bandage and all kind of fuckery. Yeah, man. You fuck her in all kind of position, man. Every position? Yeah, man, all kind of position, all CEO. And this COVID I... vaccine thing, I just one more position where, where, she, where she get in her, you know, and, and she can't do nothing about it. She have to just take fuck. And some people are going to say, why she not just change? And, and she just see all of the problem, they man, she know it over the years, and she still not change. Ego. A wretched thing. You understand? Ego bridging. Because thing. she cannot tell herself, say, everything where she go to. Is something wrong. She make a choice and that she is stupid. So she stay in the position. Indecisive. Yeah, man. As much as she born 1962 until this dear and still stretch out and still have the imagination in her head that she is independent. It's just an idea. If she can make it look like say, then she all right. But inside she are dead. So Chronix could have sing say, smile for me, Jamaica, till him drop down. Nothing to smile about after them whole heap of cock up there from powerful men when I want her. I'm going to a picture, like your spam picture, it's the same way like a typical woman, you know, especially the typical black woman. We condition for see success as being above or better than and a chase an illusion instead of putting in the work and earn in practice. True independence, which is not the, me no need no boy for nothing kind of independence. We don't think of independence. True independence, a psychological independence. Independence from the opinions we dictate on life. Subconsciously, the opinion them we are telling you how to deal with the husband, are telling you how to have, how to have it, and when to have it. That kind of mental strength, their independence. Everything else is illusion. I never hear this as usual at all about judgment, a judge, a judgment. Hey, let me tell you something, man. I know everything a judgment. Something a observation. Me I say, you can do better. You know better than this. That I no disrespect. Me know no potential and I want to live up to it. And the same message go out to Jamaica when me depict it. In the analogy, as a last female. We no want to take responsibility for her action. Exactly. Through pride. That is how she'll live. 
So it is quite possible so she going to end up like many women in them 60s and 70s with a big hole and a big throat. I think the same quite way. Possible. Yeah, man. And this one I'm now is not a political statement. Because both parties make great contributions occasionally over the years. That's true. You understand? That's me think the biggest mistake of Jamaica make is not to listen to Michael Manley when he suggests self-reliance in terms of practice, in terms of discipline, in terms of build a character. We can make a truly independent. That's so true. Yeah, man. That's so true. Me I tell you that. And every day we get up and laugh after Cuba. Them know the clothes and shoes that we just stuck over here with Instagram and take picture and think a blood clad success that. And Cuba learned self-reliance in practice, not theory, so them can stand up in high judgment. That's true. But we, we not a choice. Only the illusion of choice. And that are the true definition of slavery, when you not a fucking choice. When me, me, me ask again, what is my definition of spiritual maturity? The courage to be irrelevant, and Cuba did have the courage to be irrelevant. We never have that. We just want to show others that we have money and fame and success over other people. And guess who define this elusive version of success? The same first world slave master. And no matter how these first world guys abuse us, I will know we just use pride and a keep up image and just remain sleepy. Now we wake up. So if we we'll keep all in the position there, take fuck, fuck, fuck. In the meantime. In the meantime and between time, what is coming is coming. All right, yes, I'm going to play a song, you know, and this song, you know. And for the people, them where them now try to make it look like say, you understand, them no live for those make everything appear, say it all right. Them live for put in the work we take for manifest certain things. And right now, me have changed the narrative in this country, I rest there. I'm going to use shame and do it. Shame can yeah, be man. used positively, my brother. Yeah, man, shame, like everything else, of its value. You know, you must say everything have a value. I just, I just because we lose the balance for use these necessary things. Because I remember fear of judgment, you know. Remember human self conscious you know. I remember fear of judgment. You have to just know how to use that fear. And shame them into greatness. Don't take none of the excuses of them are fine and them victim playing and, and the person the fault and the one day over there. So why this and that? Shame them out of the show where them are put on. No feel no way if you tell them so them can do better when they know they are true. And don't business how them are going to feel because of that them use and make you afraid to tell them the truth. Now this song here for some people who love going like them great. When it come to riches them can win any debate. And have X5 park up a board house gate. Or a hide from landlord when the rent late. Now big up St. Mary Panda one here it is coming from... Yaksta aka Bush Lad in name Ambition. Here go. That's the daddy. Go in the meantime. In the meantime. Yeah, man, if you know, so this is Leela I can write and now you're listening to In the Meantime with Curly Locks, the voice. Box. Check it. February 5th, 2021. And all reputable online platforms. All right. The letter of the day coming to in the meantime radio show at gmail.com is coming from Teresa McMillan. She said, Good night, Curly Locks. I am writing to you from all the way in Anguilla. All right. Big up Anguilla. She said, I'm a big fan of in the meantime. It has changed my life in so many ways. I just wrote to ask a quick question. I've heard on various occasions where you talk about parental governments who exploit the consequence of our actions. Could you expand on this? I think I need a better understanding. Also, I have a six-month-old son that I call Zion after your son. Your story about his impact on you is so inspirational. He has touched many lives vicariously to his father. Keep up the good work. Jobless. All right, Teresa, I have a part of the program named Old MacDonald where might help you have a better understanding yeah, regarding the, the, the question we ask. So, if you see, say, you call the youth Zion, man, it's an honor. I tell you that. Yeah, man, I have to see the impact where my make for others. Yeah, man. So, stay tuned and give thanks. And this section of the program is brought to you by Bamboo Cottage Distributors. 
Bamboo Cottage brings the Jamaican culture to those in the USA who cannot go home for whatever reason. Them supply products from Grace Walkers with Lasco, Sunshine, Maggie Tasty, Magnum, Red Stripe, Salt, Mackerel, etc., etc. Think about Jamaica and it there your foot. If you're not on a foot, it there your hand. If you're not on a hand, it there your mouth. If you're not on a mouth, you're salt. And if I salt, you deal with them ship that too. WhatsApp or call Bamboo Cottage Distributors. 207 200 70 82. It's at Bamboo underscore Cottage Distributors JA. Cash up accepted. Check out them link in our description down below. And for all of those people who are brave enough to want something to help them develop the courage to be irrelevant so them can spiritually mature. Whether overall or just a little bit more. Pray out of my book, Planet Hurt, Volume 1. And Planet Hurt Book. Dot com right now, yeah man, and the official release date is January 12, 2021. In the meantime, Pastor, my brother, you think most people free or are yes. they a slave? I don't know about most people, but I know I am free. I am a free man. Yeah man. In in in, in I don't but, I don't know what you're getting at. It's always but, something with Regin, you. Watch a man. No brother, stress out yourself, man. I'm gonna raise your blood pressure. All right. Have a thing with name, the section of name. Old McDonald's. Here goes. That farm, he had some pasta. E I E I O. With a I am free here and a I am free there. With here are free, there are free, everywhere are free. But a pity them don't know. <laughs> Be a tell you. Be a tell you, Rasta, yeah, man. I could care less what you think about me, but I really hope on that farm he had some psychiatrist because there are more than a few screws loose under those red, green, and gold dreadlocks. Of, of, of yours. <laughs> the business where you are saying, oh, I'll be noticing right now. I go and use this old McDonald analogy for sure the item. Yeah, man, on a deep level, how this Western world yeah, really work. Again, I go ask the item for look on the business model of the world, especially the Western world, as a farm, as a plantation. Yeah, man, consider the corporate business infrastructure as the plantation itself and the corporate slave master. As old MacDonald that owns this plantation, aka farm. Now I want the item imagine poor people as the animal them on the farm. Then I want you imagine say people, especially poor black people, is no different from any other farm animal and any other animal on that farm in any other department and that farm or factory then. All right. Now. Let me try to absorb it. You need to take your time. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Yeah, um, let me try to... All right. Yeah. You're saying that um, yeah. uh, the black people, poor people, are yeah. not different from um, any of the animals on the on, on the farm in, in any of the uh, department. Is that what you're saying, my brother, right? Yeah, well. Yeah, if, if that's what you're saying, right, yeah. I know for a fact that all farm animals have their purpose and, and, on the farm. And the farmer, my brother, mm. benefits from... Um, Goods and or services that these animals provide. I know yeah, that, um, for example, yeah. you get the eggs from the chickens and you get um, mutton from the goat to be curried at a later date and um, you get wool from the sheep. But I don't see where you... Um, what, 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 uh, what products, goods or services could be exploited from poor people or poor black people as you stated. I understand the metaphor, my brother, but I don't see the correlation. I, I, I don't get it. Bridget, let me say it for like a million times now, Bridget. Old MacDonald exploit behaviors will come from a belief system where he make and give we will inspire these behaviors will lead to him continued financial benefit when him turn them in a spiritually blind and docile farm animal called a consumer. And him especially love the one him take for Africa. 
You always say that um, all the conflicts in the world that we experience are uh, it's more a matter of rich versus poor and um, that all other conflicts fall below this one and this one supersedes all. I see him wiggle, man. Yeah, man. What keeps this conflict into place, though? What what what, what would you say keeps it going, man? Because brother? don't both, get it. Both the slave master and the slave have misguided ambitions will come from the same source. The need to be important, the excessive need to be important. Neither the slave nor the master nor have the courage to be irrelevant when necessary. Both are prisoners of them ego. You have to understand? Both the slave are, are the animal then and the master which is old MacDonald are both slaves to the idea that success is being above and having more than and not equal with. The ego are the real master in the equation because old MacDonald is a slave to him ego just like the slave where he by head slave. So don't get it twisted a slave or end slave. Slave! How them do that? I was just about to ask that. <laughs> Alright, let me tell you. No child at all you can think of. Never born with them beliefs, you know. I inherit them, inherit them, you know. Learn behavior. Yeah, man. I tell you that. Bridging. All right. A child never asks you something yet. Just blurt out something. I, 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 I feel like it's embarrassing, but I true. Because the, the child are living in a true state of objective reality. And we embarrass because we grow, grow it out. Because we now have a mind to override the natural state there. With everything we they make we believe from birth to adulthood. Could you simplify? All right. All right. Put it like, all right. Mm-hmm. Look at now. Mm-hmm. Picture said they carry the child and put the child in a room then, upon the farm. Then put the child in a this room. Now consider the room as the environment now, this, the natural habitat where they all grew up in. Now picture them surrounded in every aspect with the brainwash education of the school, the church, and every aspect of media. Telling them what to believe, how to believe it, therefore determining how them eventually approach everything later on in life. So we dip on a treadmill in this room we are surrounded by the media. We are create everything. Yeah, man, we keep up on that treadmill there. Yeah, man, we are walk, but we are not going nowhere. We are talk, but we are not communicate. And anyone will find the courage now to live objective truth and dive off of the treadmill and come back with any kind of liberating information is always crucified by the rest of sheep. Dog, goat, cow, and the rest of the animal them on the farm. We solidly program against them own liberation or freedom. And will destroy or bring down anybody at all. We present them with it. Because again, you know, the ego. Make them see the lie where them program for live as them identity. And see the liberator as a conspiracy theorist. And because everybody in this society, at this farm, yeah, program for assume one static or rigid identity. Everybody want the same thing because success defined as one superficial thing. So where the next man have a that everybody want. So because of this now, this family don't need no security guard or no slave master to literally watch over it. Because this reality turn the farm in a barrel and turn every other animal in a crab will make sure the next one don't get out. That's sad reality. Yeah, man. Because you have a member see old McDonald's see him one, you know. Teach we everything that is relevant. What we believe and everything will make it relevant. So anything we are going to make we free, I go, I go, I go make we appear, say we are going to become irrelevant. So we push back against it because it requires work. Yeah, man. Discipline and them type of thing that we all McDonald never tell you. So we have to do in hard if you truly be free. Because in no way you're free. You just want your stay there and service fee me interest. So the rest of animals will hold you back for the farmer. Yeah, you're man. Saying? They're going to try to hold you back, Regine, because I well, know. They're going to see what they need for doing at you when you are, you arise and they don't like think them way there. Because remember, no, when you say, I'll be ideas them grow up on in the name of process. Them don't like see anybody who is spiritually mature enough to come represent the embodiment of those processes with them yet. And these people, including your born family, including parents, you understand? Your girlfriend, boyfriend, friend, everybody. Most people are going to try to hold you back because most people are under the spell and don't realize the humans, especially those in the West, suffer based on our belief system. And every aspect of this belief system, everything we believe, lead to the prosperity of old MacDonald and him economic farm plantation. Let's say Theresa still don't get it. 
What, what time? Can you, can you simplify it anymore, my brother? All right. Picture people upon the farm like any other animal. Yeah. We, we could say a cow then. Now picture we beliefs as the cow breast. Now picture the consequence of our action as the milk will come out of the breast. Now, now picture we circumstance as the hands of old MacDonald will pressure the breast to get out this valuable milk. I'm going to show you some beliefs where the media give you and the consequence where the media's owner, Mr. MacDonald, turn in a precious milk. Belief. Men are toxic masculine fuckers who don't like women. And that women are jankro and dog shit, gold digging whores. And with minds made up on both sides that this is true. Consequence. Resentment and bitterness will come from the conflict between the genders of who is right. Result, family and or divorce court and possibly child support or even jail and prison and many other years of business where them set up for exploit. Or I should I say extract the milk from unfortunate cows found in these kind of situations. Because them know the cow now get rid of them mindset so them have to end up yourself. Yeah, same thing with belief like them don't like me call me a woman or them don't like me call me black or them don't like me call me fat. As long as you are a victim in another system, yeah, man, your breast them stretch out. Milk! In the meantime. So my brother. Yeah. You're saying in yeah. a sense that almost uh, like, like no yeah. one has their own mind. My Only brother. spiritually mature. Uh, fair enough. Fair yeah. enough. Mm-hmm. Yeah man. But uh, I, uh, many people would say that they have their own mind. I believe I have my own mind. My brother. I, I don't get it. All right. Fair enough, you feel like you have your own mind. Yeah, them feel like them have their own mind, most people. All right, cool. So let me ask some questions now then. Pastor, we mm-hmm. see how we wear this church style Gucci loafers. Yes. Why? Why Why are we wearing that? Because that I, 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 I have that right and I like nice things. I don't see where you're getting at. Well, I, I, I no, man. I don't know judgment, Bridget. I don't know judgment. Me just, me, me just ask you, the value where you place upon, let's say, the shoes, you know. You understand? Did you originate that value? The story will make you just have to have that one year out of every other shoes with some unknown name in it could have possibly stronger. Why you did have to have that one year? Did, do you think that the choice is really your choice and you originate the value where you place upon it? <laughs> don't answer that. <laughs> I don't know why you say I embarrass you. My shoes are meant to cover my feet and my clothes is to cover my body and that's that. I don't, I don't, I, I, that's it. It passed us a long time, Pastor, man. No bother with that, no bridging, man. Because I'm going to tell you this now. If our shoes now are just to cover your foot and this, we am going to do with a hundred and nine closet. We do not do with, with, with a different change of clothes every day if you go up on Instagram. It's a contest that, my bridging, man. Somebody, I tell you, say them have this and you outdo them. Nobody know more than you at a game that you play. But tell me something. Who I keep the contest? We have you so busy. That's enough you know, sister, you come in one o'clock at night, every night, tired, and wake up the next day, every day, and do the same thing. I know sister, you are put off actually living in your life, living your life till tomorrow. I know sister, you are got dead. You do have a point, my brother. It, it actually is a contest. I, 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 I can see that now. Yeah, man, it's a contest. Them inner, if actually exists. Because them don't exist without somebody else's approval because what importance reside outside of themselves. There is no inner spiritual character we can protect them from the anxiety where them experience from the things where them believe. Everything where we go after something we're in a style and all McDonald decide the style. At that, me I tell a man about one mind. So everything that we believe, you think, comes from popular culture, and that and it's something that's wearing, something that's style, as, as you say. What you mean if a style, the whole height of style, even single motherhood, yeah, man, a style, man. People don't care what is morally wrong or right. Only what is socially acceptable, what is socially right. Them go off how make them feel important or feel like a part of something. 
important. And anything will threaten to move them from the moon, destruction and the pressure bridging. The amount of time this thing are repeating at them life about what is important, who is important, who should be important, how it should be important. Why? It's rough for them in Arasa. We program for see we own upliftment as fuckery. We program for assign decency to the image of jacket and tie. So we see the Rasta man and the bush doctor as idiot. So we run, go pack up in a pharmacy and wait for poison because we think them decent. Again, did we originate the value of our place for a suit and a tie? Don't answer that. So all is ignorance not going out of style, you're saying? I wear it, I wear me, I tell you that. Because the media portray the single mother as a hero, as a strong person. So what do you think? Some little young girl who don't understand them subconscious mind I got, I, got, I got aspire to be. A single mother? Exactly. This mind made up and given to us. Destroy the chance we have at rising up and taking the rightful place in life. Because it makes us overly emotional in how we approach to everything. The things that we consider as success and power and strength has made us powerless and weak. We confuse weakness for strength and strength for weakness. Now we can't separate illusion from reality. And I saw them destroy the black family structure. Because to destroy your people, you have to destroy the family. And who is the head of the family? The man. And how them destroy the man? Them get to the female. Who is the more emotional of the two. So them fuck with our beliefs. And move her from our rightful place. Which was that divine feminine. With high moral standards. Seated high on a pedestal in masculine consciousness. So true. Yeah man. This kind of woman here was the standard. We encourage a man. Yeah man. This was the... This, this kind of woman was the, the thing we, make, we drive a man to do everything, Rasta. You understand? We were addicted to their encouragement. Now Babylon lowered them in our trap and discouraged them from encouraging we. Now based on the belief system from both sides, both man and woman, we have great intentions for each other. But the belief system creates a barrier in the middle. A barrier to communication. Now everybody out there try to make it upon them own. Following ideas that take them far from home. But right now, me I tell the woman them as a man, Rasta. Uno stronger down the think, you know. Uno stronger down the think. Uno can come off of the illusion. People who once did great things can do them again. Marcus Garvey said that. You know this dangerous concrete jungle here in Babylon. We are all we have and we are all we need. I always say woman me not generalize. I just for those who subscribe to that certain lifestyle, that immoral lifestyle. But me ask you something, you know. Uno have a really make. Them boy, them, them, them only pa boy, them different, different boy. Fuck out on the truth till you know, the same thing and can hardly talk. Before you know, realize that the whole thing is an illusion. So sad. And then you have some people, you know, where, where say them dying for see the new year and them dying for 2020 done too much crosses. And thing, you may agree, you know, we have some people actually feel say, when 2021 forward, you know, they feel say all of them problems done. And that that's a part of them problems for years. Boy, I can't say Troubles that. Troubles are know. over. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Them fees of corona, everything gone. 2021. Them, them all right. Wish the eye them a spiritually mature new year. But if I them delusion, they don't care going on new year. What the fuck? In the meantime. Hey. In the meantime, 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 in between time. Time in the meantime, in the meantime, in between time.